Well, good morning, everyone. As the sun rises from the east, so will the Son of Man come. Looking east and looking up for a, a really good reason. Okay, so to break it down, I'll leave a link for you in the description box if you'd like more details. Um, but if y'all remember, at the beginning of this war in Israel, America had agreed to back Israel by sending, oh my goodness, what, 2,500 pound uh, bombs along with tanks and planes and everything else that she would need, right, to get through this. And then what happened? decided not to. So, a couple of weeks ago, uh, nobody really had any clue or hint yet of anything, but Netanyahu had made a statement. And with that statement, um, there was some frustrating things going on, and so he kind of quieted down about it all. But the point that he was making was, we do not have enough weapons without your help, U.S., that you promised. Because we've used them all. They used them all because they had the promise. That's what I'm trying to say of getting more. They used them to get their people back. That was their whole point. Now, now who is saying right now that he's, he's, it's worth him being scrutinized by the whole world What's going to happen? Psalm 33, Zechariah 12. What? All right, does this all fit in the picture yet? He's going to be scrutinized by everybody by saying that he doesn't have enough. Yet, there will be other surrounding countries are going, What? Oh my goodness. She just declared it publicly because Gantz is heading to the U.S. right now to beg for more bombs. So, as far as Hezbollah is concerned, don't forget, these are stronger, more powerful um, terrorists than Hamas. And we know that they're all rubbing their hands right now, seeing how weak Israel is, and knowing that they could go in at any moment and wipe them out. And we know what the Word of God says about that. We're taken out of the way first. All right, we are not here. In fact, I do believe that Benjamin Netanyahu uh, declared in a video uh, something about Jacob's trouble. And what he was saying in an eloquent way was that Jacob, which we know to be Israel, is in trouble right now. She doesn't have enough ammo to finish this war and come up against Hezbollah and the other ones, okay? The Ayatollahs, everybody over there. She's surrounded. God will have to intervene. We will be taken out of the way. Breaking it down from Texas, this is Debbie. Peace out. And Maranatha. The joy of the Lord is our strength. Keep looking up. Peace out.